Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stand for a moment of silence. Good morning, Sutton High. I'm Dennis. And I'm Matthew. And today is Friday, November 16th, 2018, and it is a day four. For lunch, we have freshly baked pizza with assorted toppings. Sounds good. That sounds good. In athletics news, there will be a brief informational baseball meeting next Tuesday, November 20th, right after school in the gym. The Sutton Varsity Cheer Team is looking for members to cheer at the boys' and girls' basketball games. If interested, see Aaron Millenark or Emma Henry to register online. The Sutton Booster Club is holding its 17th annual Early Bird Tournament this weekend, November 16th to the 18th. This is their biggest fundraiser of the year and all proceeds benefit Sutton Athletics. They are in need of volunteers. Students and athletes can get volunteer hours, so please sign up. Also, a quick reminder to all juniors, class dues of $10 are due by the end of the month. Go to the school website and pay using Unipay. The collection will be available for the month of November. See Miss Shaw or Miss Erickson if you have any other questions. Seniors, cap and gown payments of $40 are due by Thanksgiving break and will need to be paid prior to receiving your senior t-shirt. Pay through the school website using Unipay. See Miss Herzog or Miss Carnes if you have any questions. And now over to Will for a special segment. Thanks, Dennis. In China yesterday, the pursuit for new types of power known as nuclear fusion made a huge leap forward by achieving six times the temperature of the sun, where nuclear fusion takes place constantly. Nuclear fusion can lead to a self-sustaining power, but harnessing this is very difficult since we need enough time to well, actually capture the power. Many countries are pursuing nuclear fusion energy, and now China is ahead in the race. Nuclear fusion power is predicted accessible in as early as 2020, and I can't wait for energy to finally be clean and limitless. Advantages of nuclear fusion include no emissions, no risk for meltdown, and nearly 4 million times the amount of energy produced by fossil fuels. They're the kind of things that make me excited for the future. Now back to you guys. Wow, that was interesting, Will. Now here's the clip of the day. Have a great day, Sutton High.